Hey, how come the doves? They're not afraid of aggro at all. What gives? Oh. Another little ride. <laughs> I'm always a little bit too heavy, huh? Welcome back to Shadow of the Colossus, aka Lizard Tail Fruit Hunting Simulator. Last time, I said that we were gonna hunt some lizard tails, but I actually didn't get a single one, so I might be jinxing myself here by saying that. Where are we going today? Oh, okay. Mm, on this side of the island, or do we have to cross the bridge? Let's just keep heading that way for now. Okay. Hey, Agro, where are you now? Here. You are already walking that way. Okay, cool. Now that we are on our 10th Colossus today, the map itself doesn't even seem that empty. Aside from maybe the top right corner, everywhere has had a little something so far, so probably we're not gonna... we're not gonna be doing that much exploring anymore, unless if we go to a brand new area. We're not climbing up on top of Agro today. Not yet. So it's somewhere on that side. Okay, we'll we'll just go in that direction for now. Desert? Is it the desert? We know that it's a snake thingy today. I'm not falling for that again. <laughs> uh, maybe we just want to try going this way again. We know there's a little bridge to connect us back to the other the other bigger strip of land anyway, so it's not- it doesn't really matter which way we go here. The desert. We know it's a snake, so this is probably gonna be pretty damn good. <laughs> okay, hold on. Hold on. Seems like if we keep going... It's not super obvious which way we're going. Where is that? Just directly in front of us? Uh... It might be around... Hold on. It might be around C4? Like C3, C4? That area? We can still go through the forest, because we know that we can get back to the other side via the forest. Agro. If we can find aggro? You wanna come give me a ride? Agro. We can go through the forest again, too. That's always pretty nice, because so far, I think that's the only forest we know of. Whereas, the grass plains and the, the desert, we have seen multiple areas of. The forest is really peaceful here. Oh! If we go near that shrine again... I know I didn't get a lizard tail from that shrine before, so maybe this time, that's what I want to do. Because we're going to be on the way here anyway. Yeah, it's somewhere around there. The shrine was... Let's walk. It's a little bit too crowded for aggro to run around all that well here. There was a shrine right here. Oh, but it's really hard to see where the lizard is because it's so foresty here. But, I see it already. Oh, did I get you? Oh. Wow, awesome. <laughs> Goodbye, little lizard. Live a happy life. Okay, there you go. The stamina doesn't go up as fast as the health, huh? It's probably a good thing. Well, if that's pretty much it then, we can just... Yeah, we can just go through the bridge that we saw before. I guess we never really looked around too well in the forest here. We could take a quick look. As long as we know where we're going. Ugh. It's all disgusting and swampy here. Yeah, no sunlight. Just to make sure we're not losing our bearings. No, no. How about here? Yep, 
Yeah, yeah, that still seems to point to maybe... Oh, wait. Hey, I just noticed this, but on the map, at the B7 region, why is there a number 3 below the cloud? Is that... is that something, or like, why...? Huh. That's weird. Okay. Yeah, I guess there's not too much else around here. Unless if we can find maybe another shrine? No? Well, it's nice to have a trek around here anyway. Let me head towards finding the bridge that we saw last time. Is that the right direction? Yeah, yeah, I think we're still... We're not exactly going here. No, I think we're crossing the bridge first. Well, we could have a look anyway. Hmm. There's some chopped off trees here. Actually, they look kind of ripped off as opposed to chopped off. So I'm not sure what happened here. Maybe a thunderstorm? Or something worse? A Colossus? Oh! Ooh! Was that the path? Okay, aggro! Let's go, let's go! While the sunlight is still around, I say as if it ever becomes nighttime here. Actually, in the very beginning, uh, when we first booted up the game, that cutscene of us traveling here with the girl on the horse, there was a nighttime scene, wasn't there? So, it seems like there are nighttime scenes, but not at all while we're fighting the Colossi. Which is kind of weird. Hey, this is a different bridge, isn't it? I don't remember being here before. Oh, we, uh. This is not a bridge at all. <laughs> I've gone somewhere else. Oh. Am I going the right way? I don't feel like we're supposed to be here to find the Colossus, but, uh... If we're here anyway, I guess. Especially because Aggro doesn't seem to want to come with me. And I'm kinda stuck here by myself. Barren lands. No shrines at all. Is Aggro ever gonna come back? There you are. We could go to the edge of this place and see what's at the edge. <laughs> Sloppy climbing up, but it works. Yeah! Oh! A shrine. That we haven't been to before. I don't even know what that Colossus is. The one that's marked right near here. Here we go. I see any lizards. <laughs> Whoa, 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 I climbed back up while I was jumping off. <laughs> oh! You're stuck, aren't you? You're stuck now! Oh, really? Did I get you? Did I get you then? How about now? There you go. Have a good life. <coughs> Now we pray. That's a really long health bar. And this is the edge of the world? Wait, that doesn't look like the edge at all. No. Hmm. I think... Yeah, the Colossus is probably across the ledge, not next to the ledge here. It just seems a little bit too barren here. But, before we head back that way, I do see that there's a fruit tree in the distance. So we might as well go. And there's another shrine there, so... Excellent. Yeah, it's, it's across the ledge. Is there a quick way for us to cross here? Oh, there's a bridge there! Perfect! Whoa! 
<laughs> Feeling energetic today, aggro? Oh, I thought they would be mean. I thought they would make me go all the way around just to get back to the other side, but thank God that's not the case. Thank the lords. Ooh. Another shrine? Where are you, demons? Hmm. Oh, come on. Did I get you that time? How about that time? Oh, but I killed it this time, so... <laughs> nah. You win some, you lose some. And there you go, another shrine. I wonder how many there are around here. I mean, off the top of my head. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 ish. Oh, maybe one one shrine for one colossus? Could be. This tree has got to have something here. It looks way too perfect. Mm -hmm. It's a pineapple. Is that it? This one big tree only has one pineapple? Whoa, it's huge! Huh. Really? Maybe they realize I'm getting... <laughs> I'm getting a little bit too many fruits here. They're trying to limit me the amount. Ooh, there's actually a... Desert over there? Huh. I don't even know which Colossus that is. <laughs> I got no clue. Oh well. If that's really the only fruit, then I guess we're gonna get going. But before we go, we could probably climb up to actually confirm. Because it seems rarer that a tree would only have one fruit than multiple. Oh, look at that. I like the cinematography here. It's very deliberate, their camera angles. Oh, there's one more here. Kind of stuck right to the tree. But I guess that's that. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Oh! Oh. Look at how big that thing is. It's bigger than my head. Oh my god. To the bridge. Okay, Agro, let's get going. Which is, I'm assuming, where we're going. I don't actually have any proof here. Do we know where we're going today? The desert? Was it? Yeah, it's somewhere across. Oh, maybe beyond that wall here. Let's go. Look at how many beams of light are in the sky now. Yeah, when you look at that dark cloud from a distance, it looks super deliberate. Nope. Yeah. Yeah. Can you jump off here? <laughs> no? Wait, how do I... Do you want to yeah. like... Do you know how to get down? You do? Okay. Oh, look at that! Another nice little beach here. That's nice. <laughs> Aggro! Yeah. Here we go. No! <laughs> Aggro! Hey, if I'm not gonna be steering you, you gotta know where to go. Slowly, girl. Get oriented. Whoa! Well, that's not really a bridge now, is it? <laughs> there was a gap there! I didn't even know until I got closer. Oh, there's another one! Jeez, that's... that's really not a bridge. I don't know if I like that all that much. It's probably somewhere there. Here-ish? There's another fruit tree here, so might as well make another stop.
Yeah. We're getting filthy rich. That is, if we could sell the fruits, which... I guess we're just eating them all the time. Well, yeah, it's not like there's any shops around here. I've gotta hunt for myself. Again, is that it? I don't see any more, but uh, let's confirm. Mm, that might be it. Yeah, they're they're really trying to limit how many fruits I get now, huh? Or maybe it's all just a coincidence. Oh, oh, it's stuck right here. It's so small, this one. Even if we don't get all of them, I guess it's not too big of a loss. Which is what I try to tell myself as I cry at night, because I don't want to miss them. I think I saw one just now, but then I fell down before I could get a closer look. Was there one somewhere up there? Okay, well, whatever. Not a big deal. Where was the one I shot down? Oh, right here. Okay, let's get going. Aggro. It's nice and sunny here. Let's see which direction we actually have to go once we get to the clearing here. This way? Yeah, we're roughly in the B3, B4 region. It's all clouds. Yeah, actually, it's not sunny anymore. That was quick. Mm, maybe we wrap around the, the high walls there. Right here? If we keep following... Does that tree have a... Oh, it does! God damn it! <laughs> There's so many fruits everywhere! If I see them, I gotta get them. I can't just go past. Oh. Three. One. Two. And... Three. Any more? I think that's it. Okay. This is the way we just came from, right? That's the tree that we were just looking at. So, if we want to go into the... The wall here... We just know it's somewhere here. But it's all clouds here, so it's not like we can see exactly where we're going. I guess this is one of those instances where we just got to um, ride aggro and walk around until we find something weird. Yeah! Fine. Fine. Ooh. Oh! Oh! <laughs> One aggro. It would probably help if I could actually look around. Instead of just staring at aggro like this. Yes, like this. So something like this. It seems like if I go this way, I'm actually going a little bit further away, though. I'm not sure about that, but I guess we'll just have a look. We've never been here before, have we? I don't think so. Oh! Hold on. If we're going back here now... Oh, okay, we might be going the right way. Keep going then. Up or down? Up, I guess? What's down there? A cave? Nothing? Yeah, it'd be really cool if I could see a little bit further than this. <laughs> 
goodness. Mm, I'm feeling kind of lost right now. I'm going through all these places here, but uh, am I actually making any progress on going to the Colossus? It's all cloudy, so we can't really tell. Yeah. Just gotta keep going. Yeah. Come on, aggro. Don't be throwing a temper tantrum now. I know the path is a little bit narrow, but you're a fit horse. You can do it. Oh, another shrine. And a cave. That's probably exactly where we gotta go, huh? Hopefully. Oh, surprisingly, maybe not. No, that's probably it. Eh, probably. Probably. Praying as always. And then I gotta get the little... The little lizard somewhere around here. Whoa, you're in a strange place today. Oh, no, 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 don't, don't, don't go, don't go, don't go. Did I get your tail? I think so. Yeah. Good luck, little guy. Have a good life. I'm gonna leave you alone now. It's dark in here. Oh, it's a desert, isn't it? Oh god. I guess because if the Colossus is snake-shaped, aka it's just one long thing, there's not much variability in where the vital points and stuff can be. So what they do is they start putting the snakes in places like the water or the desert. Because then you can make it do things like burrow in the sand or stay underwater so that you can't reach them. Is that the first time we've seen bats, by the way? Oh my god, I think so. I don't remember seeing bats here before. I think we're close. Can we come up here? No. Alright. Ooh, this looks... ...promising. Nice big clearing. Yeah, this looks like a battle arena, doesn't it? Not good. <laughs> There's some light in the the center there. Okay. Where are you gonna be coming from? I'm ready. Maybe. I don't know. <laughs> I hope I am. There's a little opening over there, so maybe this is not not the exact place just yet. Gonna check using some sunlight here, maybe? Okay. Maybe I'll be on aggro. The walking is taking a little bit of time. Well, as far as we can tell, this whole place- oh jeez. Yeah, it's a clearing. And there's some stone columns around. Not sure if we can use them for our advantage yet. Okay, this guy has fur. That's a good sign. This guy has fur. But the bigger problem is that he can burrow into the sand. It's not good. He's got little... Little fins. Just like the eel. With the little stingers. Alright. Has he noticed me? Probably, judging by the music. Mm. Can I lead him into the column? Oh, he's right here. Okay, so the pro- oh jeez. Oh jeez. Whoa! It's gigantic! Oh. Mmm, I'm getting- Whoa! Whoa, I think I'm gonna- I'm gonna die very, very soon. I gotta get back on aggro. 
Yeah, walking is not really an option here, I don't think. It's just everything's going too fast. Okay, um, at this point, I'm not really sure what I can do, but I guess I'll just circle around a little bit first. Where is he? Oh, god damn it. We gotta be careful about aggro too, because every time she bumps into something, we just completely lose momentum here. If we want to keep up top speed, then we really can't bump into anything. Okay, the dude is there. The dude is there. Do we want to just jump on his back? It seems kind of difficult because... Holy jeez! If I just jump off right now and jump off into his... Whoa! Mmm! After it jumps... There is a time when it's... Oh, jeez. Maybe I can grab onto its fur? But it seems like he's just gonna go back into the sand, so I'm not sure about that either. Now I'm following him. As opposed to him following me. Oh, jeez! Whoa! I think I got trampled! Oh! -ho! Yeah, I'm gonna... I'm gonna die very soon. Very, very soon. <laughs> no idea coming to mind right now. It's not like the other one with the geyser, because this rock here is not really... <laughs> I don't feel like we can just make it run into the rock, right? So we gotta... We gotta think of something here. Bow and arrow? Hmm... Maybe, okay, my, let's try something. We can't just wander around here and hope for something to happen. I'm gonna try and see if I can grab onto its fur. Maybe that'll work. It's hard though, because I feel like if we, yeah, like that. When it's jumping up like that, can I grab onto its fur? It goes down really quickly though. Whoa! Yeah, that is not good, that is not good. Uh oh. Quicker, a little quicker. We gotta. Like, I'm just looking around in my environment right now, and I'm not sure what can really help us. So I think we just. Uh, we just gotta. Oh, God! We gotta go for it somehow. I want to try climbing onto it, but that's really difficult because that guy's really, really fast. Where is he? Over there. Oh, this is not going to go well. I'm going to get eaten up. Yeah. Ah, oh, okay. Let's uh, let's brainstorm a little bit. If we just jump back in right now, it's gonna be too hectic for me to really think of what to do again. What did we learn there? I don't think we can walk this one. We have to use aggro probably because otherwise you get smashed to pieces like I just did. And in our surroundings, there's pretty much nothing besides for the boulders. One idea is maybe we can somehow position it so that he smashes himself into the boulder, although that seems pretty difficult. Because the only one, so far, the only one smashing into boulders is me. It's not him. <laughs> we can't use a sword because we're on aggro. Maybe we can try using the bow and arrow? Arrows are not gonna work on the boulders around us. And that guy's skin, it looks way too tough for an arrow to work on it. Well, we'll just have to see, I guess. It's, uh, it's a little bit difficult. While I'm on aggro, trying to shoot my bow and stuff. I don't see any weak points. So I'm not sure if this is gonna... Duh. Oh, well, there goes my plan of trying to, like, distract it with the, the rocks, because it just... Oh, God! Oh, hey, what if I shoot it into its mouth? Could that be a thing? 
I don't know. I guess we'll just have to give it a try. I got a pretty good thing going on here right now. Agro is just doing her thing and I'm just aiming here. <laughs> but now we know the boulders don't do anything though, because this guy just goes through them like it's for breakfast. Oh my god. Come up again. Open your mouth. Open your mouth. Oh! Wait, what? Did I hit its mouth from underneath the sand? Dude, I have no clue what I hit. Oh! Oh! <gasps> what? Oh! Let's get going, let's get going! Oh, we're a little bit far away. I should have rode aggro a little bit closer. Come on! Ah! That's one point! Come on! It's just completely immobile right now. I'm not quite sure what part I hit it. Because I don't think it opened its mouth yet. Maybe its eye? Is that where I hit it? And it's feeling blind right now. Maybe that's why it's, uh... Oh, God. Aggro! Aggro! Let's go! Okay, we got it. We gotta go again. Same method? Do we just keep going... Like this? Oh god. Oh god. I don't know. Oh, the eyeball. The eyeball, isn't it? Woo! Let's get back here. Oh! oh I thought I could pull something off by jumping directly onto its back, but not today. That's okay. We can still get up. Just climb up. How many points do you got? One more up here? Oh, it's moving around a little much. Oh! Come on! Oh. It's not getting up, but it's. It's doing its best to get rid of me. Which is, you know, I guess that's fair, because I am trying to kill it and stuff. <laughs> oh! oh, but I bet it can't really move around now, because if I shot its eye out, then it's pretty much blind. Come on! One more! Mm! Got a little greedy there. One more little one. So sometimes we hear things, sometimes we don't. Not exactly sure how that works.
Oh no. You know how uh, back when we were fighting the Bird Colossus, the fifth one? I was thinking that it was gonna be really, really bad because the bird is in the sky and we know that place is a lake, so there's no land for us. But then, while we were actually fighting the Colossus, it turned out that the water was a good thing because without the water, when it dropped me, I would have just died when I splatted on the ground. So what I'm trying to get at here is maybe I shouldn't be feeling so negative just because I know the next one is probably near some water. Maybe it's gonna be a blessing in disguise. Yeah, think positive, something, something. Pfft. I don't know, man. I don't have a good feeling about the water either way, but um, guess we'll just have to see how it is. This Colossus, I think I shot its eyes out, but I don't think I actually got clear confirmation on what I shot. I feel like this Colossus was a little bit different from everyone else, because usually if we want to get the Colossus into a vulnerable position, then we gotta find that little, the smoking red mini sigil thingy. Shooting its eyes, that's not something that we've done to any other colossus. And the eye wasn't even like a sigil point, so that's a bit unexpected. Even though that guy wasn't shooting any particles at me, it felt like he was super super aggressive because he was chasing after me. And actually, if he wasn't chasing after me, then I don't think he would have died because chasing after me is what exposed his weaknesses to me. So maybe that wasn't such a good thing for the sake of its own life. Hmm. I think I like this snake better than the other snake. Because the other snake was climbing in a line to his vital point. But this one, you didn't really get a sense of that because once you get one of the points, then you had to get off and do the other eye and then get back on again. So even though we know it's a snake thingy, it didn't really feel linear. Which I think is probably a good thing. So from this Colossus on, we gotta be a little bit careful about anything that's remotely glowing. Not necessarily just sigils. Especially because we know we have another snake coming up sometime later on. Alright, 10th Colossus. Hey, remember when I said that I was scared of um, regretting it if I didn't change to hard mode by my 10th Colossus? So I'm on hard mode right now after my 10th Colossus and I think I can safely say that I'm glad I switched to hard mode because... Yeah, I think that just matches with the scale of the Colossi more. Even on hard mode, it's not like unbeatably hard or anything. I think I like this more. Hmm. Alright, anyway. Next time we'll be fighting the 11th Colossus.